At some points, it may feel like we live entire lifetimes in front of our computers and laptops, waiting for the operating system to finish loading, waiting for a game to finish loading, or waiting for a particular piece of software to finish loading. Well, at Apacer, we are here to take care of that problem for you by showing you how to install an SSD to your laptop. But before we do that, we are going to show you guys just how long it might take your computer to boot up if you have a fairly outdated SATA hard drive loaded with a ton of programs on it. As you can see, we are using a pretty outdated laptop running Windows 7, and in this particular instance, it will take us over 80 seconds to go from cold boot to Windows 7. This is the PPSS25. We recently made a couple of videos about how to install it to your NAS, which it was specifically built for in the first place. However, it can also be installed to a standard desktop or laptop without any issues. Before we begin, it would be a good idea to back up any data that you absolutely positively do not want to lose to an external hard drive just in case something goes wrong. Okay, so before you begin removing your hard drive from your laptop, you want to remove the battery and then hold the power button for up to five seconds so that you may remove any and all electricity from the machine, just like we have done here. Now locate the housing for your hard drive as well as all the screws keeping the housing held in place and remove those screws. Locate the hard drive, unplug it, plug the SSD in, then place the SSD in the housing. Now we are going to replace the housing for the SSD, screw it back in, and then replace the battery where it belongs. Now let's do a side-by-side -side comparison of boot up times. For this comparison, we are just using two fresh installations of Windows 10 without any other programs installed to the hard drive or our SSD. It's important to note that we have had variable boot up times for our hard drive ranging anywhere from 58 seconds to 28 seconds. In this particular instance, it only took us 38 seconds. However, it is worth noting that the more programs you install to your computer with a hard drive over time, the longer your boot up times will generally take. And this is where SSDs excel. We hope that this video has been helpful. If you guys thought it was, make sure you leave us with a thumbs up if you have any questions, make sure you leave them in the comments below. And to stay up to date with a pacer, make sure you guys subscribe. My name is Ben and we'll see you all in the next one.